Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. I'm back today with a quick haul from, pardon me, scrapbook.com. Um, all right, let's just get started. Okay, so everybody knows I love hedgehogs. These were penny plaques, and I thought they were darling. Um, these are just so funny. And of course, I was a musician when I was younger, and music was a huge part of my life. So I'm going to be doing some journal prep for when we travel. So everything I'm sharing with you today most likely will be in a stamped project coming up soon. So, all right, so I just wanted to kind of put that in there. And then here was a darling LDRS creative, and I have some of the, um, the journals that I will save for next year. I'm gonna start in January on those. And um, I just thought these were darling think these were on sale. Anything you see, of course, everything at scrapbook.com is reduced. And then um, if I have a coupon or anything else, that's what I do. So anyways, and I love this one. This one says, it's the most colorful time of the year. Autumn winds are blowing. And of course, you get the pumpkin latte and all the good stuff and the little fox. So I thought those were charming. I also picked up some of the um, ephemera. This is Saturday afternoon. I am taking this on my trip. This looks very much like New England to me. I love the rose gold accents. And instead of pulling it all out, I thought I'd just show you the back. Isn't that charming? I love the pink flowers. And anytime I see an Adirondack chair, it always makes me think of Maine. So I don't know why, I just attribute that to New England. Probably the first Adirondack chair I ever saw was in New England. So anyways, I thought these would be great for the trip. I also chose this in the same line, and this is again Saturday afternoon, and I love this. Choose Happy. It's a collection of, what it, life is a collection of moments. There you go. Sorry, I couldn't read it on the angle. Enjoy today. Cameras, bikes, everything. It just looks like New England to me, and these houses, it just does. So, anyways, I thought these were charming. I'll take these on the trip. And, of course, I have the AC Thickers that I will take. And I thought these are so stinking cute. There's that same house. Let's be lazy. Choose happy. Of course, we will not be lazy at all on this trip. It will be the fastest trip ever. So, and then I think, yep, this is the last one. And hold on one second. So, the kit is one canoe, two. I don't know. Anyways, one canoe, two. So, and I love all that, and I love the pink house. So, it's not quite a New England look, but we did see houses like that. So, that's more of a craftsman, or cottage. Craft, what is it, craftsman cottage? We have one. That's what our house looks like. So, anyways, but I love the galoshes. Those are so cute. Now, here's some other goodies that I just got because they were so sweet. Of course, you know I love my llamas. And these are enamels, and they have, like, all the foiling, and, oh my goodness gracious, how could you not love those? I mean, guys, if you haven't been to Tuesday Morning lately, I mean, uh, Tuesday Morning, not Tuesday Morning, I'm sorry, um, scrapbook.com, they have phenomenal choices. And this is another LDRS stamp that I love. It's called Arctic Snowfall, number 3112, and it's the Mama Allen, the Baby Allen, the Three Owls, and, of course, we have three children that, um we raised here and so all all our love so all our love um from all of us and i love the little baby shoes and then the little um you know winter hat and scarf and you've got the little mama fox and the baby fox and we've got another fox here so you could add daddy in there and then i guess this is just a little you know fox that's wrapped up so hey foxy Mama, that's cute. Hey, Foxy Mama, and congratulations. So, I'm going to enjoy using that stamp, and I love sea turtles. If you guys don't know this, I love sea turtles. They do a sea turtle release where I grew up. I have yet to get to one. One of my dear, dear friends is very involved in it, and she, um, she keeps telling me I need to come down and go to one. And so I was like, okay, okay. And it is on my bucket list, so. And then I got the seat, this, the stencil as well. Well, I have it kind of covered up. But anyways, I thought this was really fun. These will be in my, um, my journal when we travel. I'm going to take that. And then this is a stamp that I'm going to share. It's by LDRS. It's their, I think, 
I think I got this one free, but I, or I got it at a reduced price, but it's SBC 101. They may have it for sale by now. And I'm going to put, if anybody is interested in the fall camp, which is a gratitude and Thanksgiving camp, it will be November 1 through Thanksgiving Day. Um, it is all about being thankful and having, you know, showing gratitude. And it's a, it's a Bible journaling camp. So, everybody will get this stamped out for you. I'm going to do something for y'all with this stamp. So, you can put it in your in your um, your journal that we're going to be doing, or you can use it in some other way. But, I want this to be something that I will do for y'all. Okay, I also picked up the paper to that Saturday afternoon, one canoe two, and this just looks like we're going to be in Maine, and that's how I remember Maine, and... Of course, I love anything rose gold foiled and rose gold foil flowers, and I don't know. To me, there's some fall colors in that and some fall colors here. So, And then there's some word fetty that I can use and cut apart. So, just a really quick, so you guys can see. And there's some cut aparts. So, and sometimes in the 6 by 6s you get cut apart, sometimes you don't. But you definitely get them in this particular size tab tablet hold on and I don't want to misquote the size that's a whole scene you know I'll cut that out and put it in my journal so and I'm deliberating I was only going to take my dilutions dialogue and my um, I think it's an 8x5 journal by dilutions um, but I think I may take my larger one I'm not sure because I want full scenes like that but this one is 6x8 I want to say 6x8 it was good okay I love this stencil I love how it just goes out and I love this. To me, this looks like peacocks. To some people, it looks like waves. And I can see both. So, those are both by Hero Arts. And if you guys are here, there will be a drawing. I ended up with two of these. So, at the end of this video, if you stay to the end, I'll tell you how you can win this stamp set. Okay. So, I picked up this other new dilutions. And I love this. This is my favorite part of the whole stamp set. I mean, it's all fun. It's all, you know, <laughs> it's just all crazy fun, you know, Stein Reevely. So, I love all of her work. So, all right. And then I, the main reason I got this one was the fawn. I wanted the little deer. I love it all. I love she has it in her hair. I love all the houses. That's how you feel like when you're looking for houses. They're just totally in your head. Um, I kind of feel like that's going to be my brain turn of the year because I'm going to be um, kind of redoing our house a little bit. Not a lot, just a little bit. We don't have lots of extra money, but I'm, you know, I want some things. Um, I, I've had the same countertops forever. There's literally holes worn in them. There's breaks in the countertops. They're old Formica. I'd like to replace the countertops, and I'm not even asking for granite. I would love to have granite but or something thereof, but um, probably just more Formica. And then um, replace the linoleum on the floor that's been in bad condition since literally day one. And um, and then we are down to one and a partial burner on our stove oven set. That's all that works. So I'm, I finally told my husband, I concede we can replace the oven and the stove. And we'll probably do that over the holidays, probably Black Friday. But um, And we will do probably all the work ourselves except for... The flooring we'll have somebody else come in and do that but um yeah and my husband wants to tile it but we're in a it's not a flat surface we're in a we have a house with a basement it's hardwood flooring and it's it's with age it is bowed a little bit so laying tile is really not an option i keep telling them so um i concede for my fine so anyways and there's for my that looks like tile now and wood and everything else so i love this because she has the tear in her head and to me, that looks like a little girl when they kind of lean over. But i got to find a little girl head. So, And I like, kind of like her, too. She's fun. And then I got this one for Christmas. So um, I added a few things to my dilutions. I also bought... Whoops, sorry. There goes my phone. I also picked up a couple of these. The sunshine. And then this is rain. And this is cloudy. And I want to make a whole bunch of these to put ahead in my journals for days, you know, when we're journaling. So, hold on. Let me set that back to the side again. I also picked up a llama washi with foil pink. And it has the little cactus on it, too. And then I love this one as well. So, I'll probably use that in my um, planning this week. And I'm behind on my planner videos. 
So, and then finally, I also picked up just a straight date stamp. I appreciate the um, uh, Illustrated Faith one, but I really want just a straight date stamp. I'm going to literally take this with me on the trip. This is the One Canoe 2 Saturday afternoon, and they are put out by American Crafts. I've been meaning to say that. So, literally, I am just, that's what I wanted, and that's what I got. And so, this one starts in 2014, if I go back and do... Um, some scrapbooking and it ends in 2025 so this one has a little bit of leg to it there's there's some longevity okay I can't I always deliberate should I show you paper but I didn't get that much this time so I'm gonna show you so here's some more of that one canoe two Saturday afternoon and there's that chair again though I always remember them being white in New England and then here is the back of that so I love that and that almost looks like water or snow or something. It's just beautiful. Okay. So I picked up two of those. And then I should just switch these around so you guys can see better. Sorry. And then I love this. I bought, I think, two. At one point I had four in my cart. Um, I have a scrapbook page in mind in my 12 by 12 scrapbook. Um, I want to cut one out, you know, put it, you know, raise it. Um, and just, just do some different things with this. And if I do the page and I like it, I'll share it with you guys. And then here's the back of that, which I love too. It just looks like grass. So now I kind of wish I had bought more than two, but I really love this. This is again, the Saturday afternoon, one canoe, two. I love that paper. That will not go in my journal. At first I thought I would cut it in slits and put part of it in my, uh, my travel journal. And then I thought, no, I don't think so. Of course, you know I love llamas. Had to get me some llamas, and I love the back of this. And some of this, one of these I will put, um, I will use in a project. And another one I bought two so I could cut out the llamas, you know, because I can use those in my journals. They're small enough. Okay, and I got two of those, and that is really good paper. And that is Well Hello, and it is by my mind's eye. So, there you go. All right, friends. Now, let's see here. Look at this llama page. Isn't this gorgeous? I love it. It's like a watercolor. I'm definitely cutting this apart. I'm putting part of this in um, probably my journal journal, part of this in my travel journal, um, or my just journaling journal. I haven't decided yet. I even love the branding strip on this. And look at the back, too. Doggone it. Isn't that cute? So, I love that paper. I now regret I didn't get one more of that, but you know, that's how it works. Got to make it work. And then I picked up the sticker sheet. This is by Photoplay, and I love this. To me, it's very, of course, bohemian. I love the peacocks. I have, a, you know, the peacock stencil. I thought I would put that with that um, in this kit. It's got blessed. You know, I love all that. And you can make cards with this. You are awesome. You are loved. And I love you lots with the double L's like llamas. There's Llama Llama, and then just pretty, you know, beautiful art that I just love. I love the feathers, love the teacup, love the little camel. So, anyways, I love that. I may, I don't think I'm going to take that on the trip. And then la that was the end of it. So, that is it. This is my um, scrapbook.com. If you guys don't go and look at scrapbook.com, I just highly recommend when you are pricing out something that you like i highly recommend that you go look at scrapbook.com as well their prices are very very competitive in my opinion and i always i always when i'm looking at one thing i always make sure i go look at scrapbook.com because to me i can find really good deals at scrapbook.com so um just a thought you know not saying you have to or anything i'm just trying to encourage you and then of course here's all the goodies for our trip and i'm trying to see what fits in the in the viewfinder what doesn't so long story short this is a big variety of goodies but i wanted to share with you all right my dear sweet friends if you stay to the end and you would like to participate in the drawing of these cute little animal stamps by Dilutions. And of course, Dilutions is the, um, it's a ranger line, and the designer is Diane Reevely. Um, you, all you have to do is be subscribed to this channel. 
you have to leave a comment below about what is your if you were to win this stamp, what would you do with it? Would you make a card with it? Would you put it in your journal? Would you, you know, what, how would you use this? I think this is so fun. I love the tight print on top of the critters. Of course, our um, grandbaby, um, her her theme is woodland animals. Our our granddaughter that is to be be born this fall, and so I love this. So you get heads and tails is what they call this. So, isn't this fun? I know. So, again, you must be, sub be subscribed, live in the United States, be 18 years or older, and leave a comment on how you would utilize the stamp in your crafting. Okay, my dear sweet friends, um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and thumbs up really help our channel to grow. And I would really ask you, if you enjoyed this, please, 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 give me some feedback. I would love that. And, um, also, if you... Um, I just realized we've had that in there in the corner. Forgive me, I didn't realize that little cord was there. Um, it's My camera angle is like a funny angle, so it doesn't even, it looks like a negative image, so I apologize. And um, I will get better in the next video, of course. Um, if you are not subscribed, we'd love to have you. You have to be subscribed to participate in the drawing. So that's a big deal, and we would love to have you. More, most importantly, this channel is built on encouragement, and we'd love for you to be a part of it. And then lastly, um, leave a comment, especially if you want to win. And, and also leave in that comment, I want to be in the drawing. But if you tell me where you'd use it, I know. Never mind. Just leave a comment if you want to be in the drawing. And leave a comment if you like the video. And lastly, if you think this would encourage somebody else, please feel free to share this video. Okay, friends. Now here's the most important part of this whole video. I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. Thank you so, so, so much for stopping by. I will be talking to you soon. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.